Hi, I'm Dave Martin from Martin Pastoral Limited. Um, we farm here in Wairau on the east coast, 2,000 hectares of hill country sheep and beef breeding and 170 hectares of mixed cropping, beef finishing, lamb finishing. It's a great place to be around here, good climate, we're pretty summer safe, good rainfall. We're running about 13,500 stock units across the two farms. This business is uh, 119 years old. We've generational farm and we're looking to keep farming for the future so sustainability is really high on our list. The breeding property is at 2,000 feet at the top of a hill so any sediment that comes out of our property can affect others so we're very conscious about what we do, where we do. Our hill country block is predominantly pumice soils, means it's really good for wintering uh, the large cattle up there. We have sort of about 680 cows and they can handle, that country up there really handles it. It's reasonably free draining and the cattle don't make it huge mess during the winter, especially in wet winters. It's actually quite stable. It's really good hill country farming area. It, it suits pasture, not trees. So I uh, contacted Josh. We'd been working together with the East Coast Farming Expo and uh, he came out and we sat down and sort of walked through the site and the levels and he brought out a couple of different plans and from that we custom designed a plan that would work for our yards. Things that we talked about that were really good for us were the uh, calf reducing panels. They're really important, we're taking in cattle at 200 kilos and they're going out at 630, 650 kilos, so we require a race that goes you know, from this to this. The cattle run in, they can't turn around and it, it speeds the job up amazingly. If we're doing a straight way, we can put through 100 yearlings in an hour, just under an hour. The flow is the key and they just pour through the race. We use our crush for most stuff. We do all our drenching with oil drenches. All our oil drenching is done in the crush. Young cattle, big cattle, it's just so easy. All our tagging, dehorning, makes life really simple. The squeeze and the crush has been really invaluable for us. Um, it's another one of the tick the box things on the, on the design sheet that we wanted. For us, it, it changed how we looked at um, stock growth. And so we went from you might check weigh a mob because it was, you might weigh a few cattle out of a mob as a check because weighing was a pain in the backside to weighing everything all the time because it's so quick and easy. It's changed the focus of how we finish our cattle. Another good feature is the width of the um, kit walk, uh, nice and wide, and two of you can walk past each other with no worries, you're not sort of getting too close. The man gates are brilliant. Um, you can sneak through behind a mob or in front of a mob to open a gate. It's really quick and easy, you're not having to open up big gates and scare the mobs. Maintenance is minimal, grease a few joints, tighten the odd bolt, nothing breaks, it's steel, it flexes. We built this two years ago and gosh, if we'd done more than an hour and a half an year in that time, I'd be surprised. We built this facility and it was just a revelation for us. We suddenly started doing things because it was easy. Once you put them in, it's, you sort of wonder why you didn't do it 10 years ago. It's addictive putting in facilities that you use a lot and make life a joy to work. If someone said to me they were considering building a set of wooden yards, I'd suggest them to go and find a set of steel yards like these and work with someone for even for a couple of hours. Check them out, check out the ease of stock flow, the ease of getting around the yards, the neat little design features that these steel yards have that you can't put into wooden yards and then make your decision. Definitely wasn't the cheapest option to build a set of yards, it is one time do it right and we won't be doing it again in this facility unless we expand it. It's a joy to work in the facility. You know, the cattle flow, everything works, it's clean. It's just really such a joy to work in here. Get in, get out, the job's done.